come across this thing coming up the road here in Ozark, Alabama. Looks like a little restaurant next door to it. And a little church next to it. Old Lincoln. Put a year on that for me. Four door. Rockers are bad in it. Lower fenders are gone. Skirts seem to be missing. It's a Capri. Lincoln Capri. Now look at the back of that thing. That looks pretty good. Got a Georgia tag on it. Government tag, no less. Well, I don't know. Cobb County, November. I can't tell what year that was. <clears throat> That's a pretty cool car. <clears throat> Got a chalk behind the wheel, so I don't know what that means. Drive shafts out of it, maybe? Or the tranny. Let's open this thing up, see what we got. Oh yeah. Got some rubber on a box. Window seals or whatnot. Headliner's falling down a little bit. Some parts in it all, all over the place. Kind of a cool dash. A little simple though. Look at that nice new door sticker thing. That's a good looking car. The rockers are gone on this side too, especially down by that back door. Fenders up here a little rotted. Put a year on that. I'm thinking in the 50s. Here's an old car. I'm at this junkyard in Abbeville, South Carolina. Looks like a Cadillac. Put a year on it for me. Looks in pretty nice shape. It's in real good shape, actually. Don't have many older cars at this junkyard. I just saw this one sitting here. There's one up front, too, I'm going to get. I was talking to the guy inside. He said this is a 55 or 56 Mercury. It's a solid car. We're looking at quarter panels. Not a bit of rot on them. A little bit of rust on the bottom of this door. But not too bad. The front clip's missing. Got the hood inside. A little bit of surface rust up here. Glass is falling out of it though. Um, some parts in here. I just don't see the fenders. I see headlight bezels, wing windows, the hood. Got flames on it, flames on the hood. It's not too bad car. Hey, Bucci. What you doing, huh? Um, yeah, she's solid. She's solid as can be. That little dog out here almost ate my ass earlier. <laughs> Wouldn't let me out the car. Now he's my buddy. All right. I've been driving by this car for years. <laughs> Finally gonna stop, get a video of it. I thought it was turned around the last time I was here, so somebody must be coming here. It's a two door. Let me know what year you think it is, and tall grass here. Let's see what we got inside. Seats are gone. Dash is in nice shape. It looks like a three-speed on a tree. It's a Chevy.
pretty solid car. Rocker's look in good shape. All the chrome is missing. You know, they probably were going to start to do a body and paint on it. But, uh, they never did it. Let's see if I can open the hood. Nope, I can't. Straight six. Six volt. Look at that battery. <clears throat> yeah, it's a pretty solid car. Pretty solid. There's some parts inside of it. Uh, the quarter panel here is a little rotted. Right there. Yeah. Again, give me a year. I'm in uh, Abbeville, South Carolina right now. All right, this is Pinky's South Union Garage in Towing. They were nice enough to let me go in and look at some cars, which I took videos of, which you'll see at, right after this introduction. But this is the main reason I stopped. Just ask me if I can videotape this truck. If y'all could put a year on this for me, I would appreciate it. But that's a big boy right there. Top of that cab is, uh, I suppose with flat tires, is about seven feet tall. Looks like the back of the truck is missing. It is. Oh, look at that. Look at that little seat up there. For working the winch. <laughs> Whole tractor seats in this thing. That's wild. Big old boom on it. It's a C. It's a Ford C750. Look at that big old chain. That's sweet. And there it is, Pinky's South Union Garage. 24 hour towing. Check out this car. Duster. I'm at a towing company here in uh, Alabama. I just came in asking if I can have permission to take a uh, video of their tow truck outside. They gave me permission to do that, but they said I can also do a little video of stuff inside. So this is a nice little car. And then we got this old, this thing almost looks fake over here. No, it's steel. <clears throat> and then there's another car over here I want to get a picture of, a little Camaro. That's sweet. All right. We're doing the quarter on it right now. The trunk, this, this is my wife. I bought it for green car, so I'm redoing it for her. Oh, yeah. This is how we got it out of the barn. 64 and a half, huh? Yep. So we cut the quarters off of it. All right. What size motor did it come with originally? 289, three speed. Nice. Was it on the floor, the shifter? Yep. Yeah. Wow. Sixty-four and a half. Maybe I can get some pictures when it's completed from the guy. That's, that's, that's a lawnmower build. And there's a lawnmower build right there. <laughs> that's cool. Look at the gears in that thing. All right, yeah, square body they're doing here. They actually do some service and the repair also with towing 
big old square body four wheel drive they like their square bodies there's another one over here that he's doing Little big old slicks on that thing. This is a race truck here. Let's see if I can get a shot. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna shift her in there. Definitely a race truck. He says they're fixing the paint this big monster here next to me. Big four wheel drive blazer. And like I said, this is a towing place, which I'll get the name off the front of the building when I go back out. Here's a truck they're working on. They got some cool stuff here. And here's an old rat rock. Look at that thing. Dooleys, fuel tank in the back. Big old rear end in it. This thing's been chopped. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. And then he said he had something over here. Let's see what it is. Oh, it's a Camaro. 80. I mean, if you could put a year on this stuff for me, please do. Oh, that's nice. It's got the, it looks like it got the exhaust coming right out behind the uh, front tire there. I can't get in there too good. It's kind of a lot of stuff in the way. Put some years on these things for me.